What's going on YouTube? It's your man's fruit gushies, you know what I'm saying? As y'all cannot tell by the title of the video, or and yeah, see, as y'all can see by the title of the video, I'm giving y'all my dribble sigs. You know what I mean? These are the best dribble sigs for Steezo dribbling, ISO dribbling, all that glitchy cool stuff. As y'all can see by the beginning of the video, I'm pretty damn unguardable. I'm all over the damn place. I'm literally moving. I'm moving though, bro. I'm actually like out of here. Like I'm moving. Gone. Nobody can guard me. I'm literally like actually flying. And my build is OP as heck. And I'm going to definitely be dropping that as well soon. But yeah, these are the dribble sigs for glitchy dribbling, all that Steezo, ISO stuff. And all that stuff. But yeah, I'd appreciate if y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that little notification bell, you know what I'm saying? And check me out on Twitter and TikTok. I also post content on there as well. But yeah, let's jump up into the video for all these crazy glitchy dribble dribbles. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, let's go. Now we're on to the core. I'm going to be showing you guys all the drill moves and what they do. And all that cool stuff. Like, as you guys can see, I'm all over this damn core. I'm already doing all my cool, glitchy, glitchy stuff. You know what I mean? I'm right there. Don't worry, though. Hey, got his ass. Let's go this way. Boom. Into this. Oh, wait. Hold on. We're doing, we doing Sham Gods backwards. Oh, my gosh. Into the freaking Haspin. Into the freaking cool little glitchy thing here. Boom. Into that. Another Haspin. Oh, my gosh. We're freaking moving. We're all over the damn place. Oh, well, let's see. Oh, my gosh. No, Sham God backwards. Oh, my goodness. Hop jumper, chicken. You know what I'm saying? Bro, I'm about to give y'all the greatest sigs. You're going to be moving all over this court, man. Y'all are going to be moving. I'm literally cruising. Look at me. Oh, I'm messing up. But it's all good. But yeah, let's jump right into the first sig, which as you guys already know, the first sig, you guys should know the first sig, man, is the dribble style. The dribble style that I'm using is Darius Garland. The reason why I use Darius Garland is because I'm pretty sure it has the fastest same side speed boost i've used a bunch of them and this seems to be the best for me and the fastest but like look look at his speed boost bro look how fast he's i'm out of there i'm literally out of there it's like l2 canceling damn near. I, I mean i've seen a video you can l2 cancel supposedly but to me this is kind of quicker but i guess you can kind of l2 cancel but yeah the that's why i'm using darius garland has such a quick freaking speed boost out of his freaking same side and like he's just fast he's just a really fast dribble so you can do like this look at that like look look at his speed boost bro his speed boost is so fast look at that oh my gosh he's gone out of there yicking psych i missed but yeah that's the dribble style i'm using i am using darius garland dribble style and all that good stuff but yeah uh let's get into the next sig let's go the next dribble sig is going to be your signature size up and i am using trey young that is what i'm using it's this right here that's what you're getting right there all you're doing is just with your right stick top left or top right to get that little front crossover and then also with this you can also do some cool stuff with it um with this with this like that kind of you can do like other cool stuff too but that's another video for the, to teach you guys that stuff but yeah um that is what I'm using. The signature size that I'm using is Trey Young because I think it has the quickest speed boost. Not gonna lie, this stuff is very, very quick. Yeah, it's very, it's very quick, and it's just like a cool little quick front cross. Just run right by them, slam dunk that thing. Let's go. Look at that crap. But yeah, that is what I'm using for my signature size up. Let's get on to the next drill move. Let's go, people. Now the next drill move that I am using is my regular breakdown combo. I am using. Ray for Alston, it looks just like this. I'm not, I just used this shit last year, but I'm not gonna lie, I'm, it's, I haven't even used it once this year. I haven't used this once. I only used it once last year because it had a cool, like, glitchy move in it, but I'm not using this no more. So there's really no point to even really use these this year, I feel like, unless there's like a cool one that has a glitchy move in it. But I haven't, I haven't started using the regular breakdown combos really yet. So yeah, but that's what I'm using. I'm using Ray for Alston. Uh, regular breakdown combo and that is what oh my gosh you saw that sham god backwards holy crap i'm freaking disgusting man hold on let's see hold on wait, wait let me not mess up real quick the, oh i messed it up i messed it up i was trying to show you guys some cool stuff but yeah um that is what i'm using regular breakdown combo ray for Austin, and that is that is definitely uh, i don't ever use that but yeah let's get on to the next show move 
Now, the next dribble move is going to be your aggressive breakdown combo. I'm not gonna lie, I do this all the time. It's of course the John Moran that's here from last year. I use this because it likes to get me like right into that half spin like that, and then I can do like cool connectors. Out of the John Morant, you can also do that out of it. Freaking cool speed boost. Like, there's so much you can do with John Morant, so I really do like it a lot still. But I'm not gonna lie, they buffed steals, I think, today. So, um, it seems to be like it's been getting ripped a little bit, but not as much if you just know how to, like, keep your distance and stuff. So, I'm still gonna use it for now. But, yeah, I like aggressive breakdown combo John Morant a lot still. Because, I mean, it can throw me right into the Luka like that, green. Like it, it just creates space for you. It just creates a lot of good space and all that good stuff. But yeah, that is what I'm using. I am using aggressive breakdown combo, John Morant. Let's move on to the next dribble move. Now the next dribble move is going to be your escape. It's Steph Curry, it looks just like this. It's just turbo and then diagonal up left or right, like a crossover, standing still, looks just like that. I like this, uh, it has a pretty good speed boost out of it and it kind of like messes people up because it like delays a little bit like that, see that? And then you like just speed boost out of it so you can be like a little hop jumper, boom, get out of there, you're running, you're gone. Gone skis, gone skis. I think you can also L2 cancel with this, like that, I kind of just did it right there. Uh, but yeah, that just did it again, but that wasn't with that. That was something else. I don't know what that was, but um, yeah, I yeah, like there, just did L2 cancel. Uh, it's pretty quick, it's pretty quick. You can L2 cancel with it, it looks pretty good. And I like his escape package, this is what I've been using this whole time, but yeah, um, that's what I'm gonna use for now. Oh, that was nasty. You guys seen that? Oh my goodness, we're moving, we're moving, we're moving. Oh, I missed. Oh my gosh, we're moving, we're moving. Oh my gosh, we're moving. Oh, I messed up. I messed up, fellas. I messed up. But yeah, that's what I'm using. I am using Stephen Curry escape moves. So throw that on. It's really quick. It's a good escape. And just put that crap on. Now let's move on to the next dribble move. Now, the next dribble move is your combo move. Now, I'm not going to say anything too much about this, but I am using, um, what's it called? Jordan Poole. And I don't really ever do the combo moves as much this year. I don't really ever do them, but they look like that, I think. It looks just like this. Yeah, that, that's that's what it does. It's just like a left-right flick type thing. That's what I'm doing. Well, it's not even doing it. Hold on. I don't ever do combo moves, I'm not going to lie. There, That's what I guess that's what the combo move is for this. But yeah, I'm using, uh, what's his name? Freaking Bradley Beal. Bradley Beal's pretty good. If you want to put that one on, that's what I'm using. But yeah. Uh, I'm using Bradley Beal combo moves. Throw that on if you want to be using those, but I don't really redo combo moves. But yeah, that's what I'm using. Another good one is the same one from 24. I think it's LaMelo Ball. I'm pretty sure that's again in this game this year, but I don't know. I don't use my combo moves, so yeah. But let's move on to the next dribble move. Now, the next dribble move is your crossover. You're moving crossover. I'm using Chris Paul. This is by far, by far the quickest crossover in the game. And yeah, it looks just like this. You wanna see it? Boom, it looks just like that. It's, it's kind of like John Wall a little bit. It's like not as straight, but like, look at, you can like easily say you're just dribbling, dribbling, dribbling. Oh my gosh, we're going this way. I'm just doing like random stuff right now. Go that way. Boom, let's go over here. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. I messed up a little bit. Hop jumper, crossover, dunk. But like you can do it the same way as last year, like at the hash, if you wanna get a dunk off, you can just go like right here, run over here. It's just saying you're running this way, cross over to the paint dunk just kind of like last year obviously it's not going to be the same exact thing as sean wall but that is what i'm using that is definitely the best um that's definitely the best uh crossover that i'm pretty sure it's like in the game the fastest for sure but yeah that is what i'm using I'm using john wall crossover not john wall what the heck chris paul crossover chris paul crossover so he's 24 so gosh dang i said john wall chris paul crossover is what i'm using but yeah Let's move on to the next dribble move now. Now, the next dribble move is Trey Young behind the back. It's the behind the back. I'm using Trey Young. It looks just like that. You can spam it up the court. It's a lot slower this year, but it has the quickest nutmeg. So you can like do like behind the back into another nutmeg like that. You can do behind the back into like the nutmeg into a little half spin and do like all that cool stuff. That's what I'm doing. I'm using Trey Young behind the back. This is definitely the best behind the back in the game, I think, as of right now. It also has the quickest nutmeg, just like 24. It has the quickest nutmeg, so that's why I'm also using it and all that good stuff. But yeah, let's see if we can move real quick. Hold on, hold on. 
Ooh, hold on. Hold on, wait. I'm messing up a little bit. Check me out, check me out, check me out right here. Hold on, wait. Oh my gosh. Sham gods. Hold on. Half spin. Another half spin. Over here. Oh my gosh, crazy cool move. Let's do this other crazy cool move. Hold on, let's go over here. Boom. Oh my goodness, look at that. Yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh. Well, that was corny. But hold on, let's go. Chicken. All right. Now, let's get into the next real move. I got a cool little cook sesh right there. But yeah, let's go to the next move. Now, the next dribble move that I am using is, actually, I kind of forgot. Oh, Terry Rozier. I'm using Terry Rozier. I was using Anthony Edwards because I had a cool spin in it, and it has the Jamal Murray. But I kind of got annoyed of the other spin that Anthony Edwards has. So now I'm using Terry Rozier because it also has the Jamal Murray half spin from 2K24. That half spin right there. So that's why I'm using this. I'm using this half spin because it has the half spin in it, and it's a very good move, this move right there that half spin i love doing that but yeah it's the same half spin from 2k24 so make sure you throw that on and get moving we just did double sham god so that was nasty but yeah as you can see we're moving pretty damn good already on this game and i'm actually pretty unguardable while all these other guards are kind of struggling a little bit and all that good stuff so yeah if i were you guys i'd definitely put on these six you'd be unguardable as you can see i'm like cruising out here but yeah let's move on to the next dribble move let's go the next dribble move that you all are gonna be finding out is my hesitation now the hesitation that i'm using is pro i use pro hesitation because you can quick stop out of it very quick i just like pro i know you can use darius garland also his is very good too but i think i'm using pro right now but yeah just they're on pro and uh or Darius Garland, either one, they're both good. But Darius Garland, I forgot what it has. That's something different in it of like why I use this one instead. But yeah, so just make sure you put that on. Put on Darius Garland hesitation if you want to use what I use. That's what I'm using. It looks oh, also your moving hesitation is what gives you a proper sham god. I can't I don't remember if I already said that. But yeah, it gives you a sham god, and I like the sham god it gives you in this. So yeah, make sure you put on Darius Garland hesitation. But now let's move on to the friend. Let's move on. To the next drill move this one's very important people the next dribble move is your step back and of course we're using luca this literally gets you out to the three every time this literally gets you out to three now i use luca and i combine it with the cow lori hot jumper so cow lori hot jumper look up look at the space it gives you bro if you see in all my clips that literally carries me to three like look at bro you can be at the midi green bruh it's just like luca it kind of replaced luca this year i'm not gonna lie but sometimes if someone if someone's like far behind like someone like is like really far away from me now just luca but luca and that kyle Lowry, like look boom boom you can like literally like spam them both so you do like a luca so you do like a hold on watch let me show you so you do like a luca into a hop jump damn you gotta let your player run though i just did it you guys saw it though but if you just like let your player run for a bit, do a Luka, and then do a hot jumper right after, like after you let yourself run again for a second, you can like literally like, go hella far. But look how far that brings you. You definitely need to put on Kyle Lowry hop jumper. It is so broken. Look at that. Like the, the, the amount of space that it pulls you out is like actually crazy. And it literally just like chains up everything. That with the Luka, oh my gosh, it's like actually freaking disgusting. Like look at how I'm moving, bro. I'm literally just moving. I'm moving. I'm moving. Look at how I'm moving. Look at how I'm moving, brother. Look at how I'm moving. Oh my gosh. Hop jumper. Oh, oh my gosh, we're moving. We're moving. Basic. Oh my gosh, we're back out here. Chicken. Look at how we're moving out here, bruh. And you can get some of that left stick movement too, like what Hank the Tank was doing. Like, hold on. I do it a lot, actually. Not a lot, but I, I do it sometimes. You get like the basic spins a bunch. Oh my gosh, we're moving. It's like, we ain't moving. What the hell even is going on? But yeah. That's like all just left stick moving right there to do that stuff that Hank the, Tank, Hank the Tank was doing. That's just like a bunch of left stick stuff. But yeah, um, that is all my dribble sticks for you guys. And I also made sure to throw on the hop jumper for you guys too, because that's what I spam a lot. So make sure you guys want to throw that hop jumper on. You guys for sure want to throw that hop jumper on. But yeah, uh, make sure you guys like, comment, follow, all that good stuff, subscribe. And I appreciate it if y'all would check out my TikTok as well. And, and, my uh twitter i post on both if you didn't know so but now you know so i appreciate y'all like did that good stuff check me out on that but these are the drill moves for now i'm still learning game just came out obviously but 
yeah, we're definitely going to be moving this year. I'm pretty sure. The shooting, I'm kind of iffy about, but we're going to be moving for sure, for sure. But yeah, that's all the drill moves, all the glitchy cool stuff. And I appreciate you guys for watching and doing all that good stuff. Thank you guys for watching and tuning in and all that good stuff. But yeah, I'll see y'all in the next video. I have another one coming out real, real, real soon. I got the build, I got the jump shot. Everything's coming. Everything's coming. We're dropping consistently this year. But yeah, that's all I got for you guys today. And thank you guys for watching. And I'll catch y'all in the next video. Bye, everyone.